Chris, hold on, wait. Are you sure the Michael B in? Yes, I'm positive. For the hundredth time, boy. My father is away on a business trip. He'll be gone until Monday. It's Friday. I'm trying to make sure, all right? I don't want to have to climb out of a window, right? <laughs> you won't have to. He'll be gone. We'll be fine. You sure? Mm-hmm. All right. Grace, we always watch TV. Come on, do something different. Different like what? I don't know. Maybe we can uh, head up to your room. I don't think I'm ready for all of that. Grace, how long we be dating? Four months. Four months. We be dating for four months and you still don't trust me. I do. It's just, I'm not ready to lose my virginity yet. <laughs> what are you so afraid of? What if you have sex with me and then try to have sex with some other girl? Grace, I ain't going nowhere. You're all girl I care about. That's what they all say. I'm serious, girl. Quit playing. You see, they all say that too. Nah, I'm serious. Grace, if I wanted to leave, I would have just left already. If it's ass, I'm not going to force you to do something you don't want to do. You for real? Yeah. I think you're special. You really mean that? I do. Come on, let me prove it to you. Hold on. I have to go to the bathroom. Alright. Hurry back, though. Connors. Connors. Come here. Connors. Whoa, whoa! Uh, uh, shut up! Uh, Don't say anything else. If not, what's the I said shut up! Dad, no, stop, Grace, Grace, stop. get back, get back. No, no, Dad, that's my boyfriend, Brian. What? What's he doing in my house? I thought he was breaking in. I brought him in. I thought it'd be okay. Grace, there's nothing about this that's okay. We weren't even doing anything. What you mean you weren't doing anything? Go to the family room now so I can talk some sense into you. I'm not done with you yet. You stay right there until I'm finished with her. You think he fell for it? Yeah, Dad. Great performance. Where'd you get a fake gun at anyway? So you thought you could bring boys into my house? Thanks. It, it looks real, right? It just came in the mail yesterday. Yeah, he's clueless. But you don't know him, Dad. He said I was special. What's wrong? Did you forget to do what's next? No, I just don't think it's a good idea. Listen, you said that you wanted me to meet your boyfriend, right? Now I need to make sure that he's good enough for my baby girl. Look, if he's who he says he is, then you have nothing to worry about. Yeah, but why can't we just sit down and talk? Like normal people. We are. All right, just trust me. He's a good guy, Dad. Yeah? So why did he sneak over here then? If he respected you, he wouldn't come over to my house when I'm away, Grace. But, Dad... But listen, listen. Go back and bring him to the dining room. I'll handle the rest. Okay. Okay. Fine. That's my baby girl.
So, you wanted to see me, sir? Yes. My daughter speaks very highly of you. I'm glad that we could finally meet. <clears throat> um, th thank you, sir. Right. So, uh, let's not beat around the bush. How long have you two been dating? Three months. Which one is it? Is it three months or four months? It's four months. I'm sorry. I, I got a little confused. That's all right. Yeah, we all get a little confused sometimes. Ain't that right, Grace? Yeah, I guess so. So four months. That's a pretty long time, Brian. Why'd you wait until now to come over? I, I guess I was waiting for a perfect time. Perfect time of what? To come over. <laughs> so you thought you'd get my daughter alone and do what? No, I, uh, um... <laughs> I'm just messing with you. All right, just, just relax. Just relax. <laughs> you weren't planning on sleeping with my daughter, were you? No, Dad, I wait. Why are you wouldn't force me to do anything I didn't want to do? Grace, it's okay. Sir, I would never try to force your daughter into having sex. See? Let me ask you this, Brian. Did you know that I was going to be home today? No. I mean, I, yes, yeah, yes, I did. That was the reason why I came over today. Oh, you did? Yeah. That's interesting because I remember telling my daughter that I wouldn't be back from my business trip until Monday. It's Friday, Brian. You didn't tell him this, Grace? Dad, stop. He wouldn't make me do anything I didn't want to do. You're making him. Making him what? Confused? Nervous? Yes. These are basic questions. You're not nervous, are you, Brian? Nah, nah, I'm good. I'm, I'm, I'm good. <laughs> I bet you're wondering why I have that bowl of rice in the middle of the table. Yeah, what's up with that? You see, in ancient China, if someone was lying, they would make them chew dry rice. And if they were lying, they would lose their saliva and that would make their mouth dry, and it would make the rice hard to spit back out. But, if they were telling the truth, they would have nothing to worry about. So you think I'm lying to you? You tell me. Do you love my daughter? Grace, this is crazy. Are you really letting them sit here and talk about me like this? Well, do you? Talking about, of course, I do. Chew the rice bar. I ain't chewing that. Chew the rice bar. Psychos. See, Grace? I told you, these boys are no good. All they care about is having sex. No, Dad. He left because you wanted to play your stupid game. Grace. I was just trying to help you. No. When are you going to realize I'm old enough to make my own mistakes? Let me make my own decisions. <laughs> 